I'm Alpa, the Garden to Table Manager here at The Open Door and I am just giving you a little orientation of The Open Door's upper garden. So the address is 3910 Ron Road. There's a small garden next to the house and that one is called the lower garden. This is the upper garden. So come with me. Usually there would be a lock here, but during the COVID crisis we have removed it so there's less things to touch. And there will always be um, information here on the whiteboard for you if there's anything you need to know. And once you come in, you can find your plot. I will email you with a map of the garden so you will know uh, your plot number as well as kind of where it is in the garden. Um, some of the signs with numbers on them have come off but uh, the map will be able to help you. And if you come to on-site orientation in small groups, um, you'll be able to um, have help from me and um, other people as well. So once you have your garden and you find it, you can weed it. Hopefully yours is covered with leaves from last year, like this one. We are moving to a no-till method. So we encourage everyone just to keep a lot of leaves on top of your plot to help keep the nutrients in the soil. And then when you plant, you will only make a hole wherever you're planting your, your thing and not disturb the whole soil by tilling or um, anything like that that lets all the carbon and nutrition out of your soil and into the air. On this side here, you'll find your raspberry patch. Um, there's nothing on it right now obviously but in June it'll be filled with raspberries you're welcome to take as many as you like and just remember to weigh your harvest and write it down so your shed is here so it might be a little dark in here so we'll have to let the camera adjust come on in ref So this is where all the tools are and the scale. So whenever you harvest anything from your plot or a community plot, you'll always weigh your harvest. Um, during the COVID crisis, if you're not comfortable using the pen and paper here to write down your harvest, you will be able to just take a picture of it with your phone and send it to me, email it to me. Um, but this is where your scale is and remember always anything you take out of the garden um, gets recorded. The weight gets recorded. And I think the last thing I need to show you, the last two things I need to show you, is where the strawberry patches, where the strawberry patch is, and uh, how to turn on the water. So follow me. The strawberry patch is against this back fence. You're welcome to take as much as you like from this garden. This is where the strawberries will be, and again, just weigh your harvest. And water has several hookups within the garden, but the main water needs to be turned on outside of the garden. So once you have the water on on the outside, which I will show you in just a moment, you'll be able to have different access points. So here's one of them, and they are throughout the garden. You will see them as, as you look around. There are several different points. And this is where the main water hookup is. So, as you can see, there's several places where you can turn the water on. So you will learn which hose comes closest to your garden just by 
looking at it <laughs> and then turning on the proper um, water hose here it the water should be turned on in mid-may and will be shut off mid-october so that's all if you have any more questions feel free to give me a call at 651-600-9244 happy gardening